So first start by making your window and make sure that you have your history and all that open. Look at your extensions, or I'm sorry, your workplace. Make sure you have motions open. And then also what you want to do, this is your two layers here. So this is my video layer. What I need to do is turn this into a smart object. So I'm going to go to layer and I'm going to go to smart objects, convert to smart objects. Okay, so that made that fix right there. What I'm going to do is come over to my move tool. I'm going to pick it up, move it over like this. Now it'll probably be the wrong size. Because it's a smart object, you can hold the shift key down and shrink it. Now you can do this now or later. You can fix this up later. From this layer, what we need to do is make a mask. I'm going to hit return so it kind of places it. And now I'm going to make a mask. So um, here's my tools over here, just so you can see those a little bit better. What I need to do is go to layer, layer mask, reveal all. Then notice where it picks this up here. Okay, so now white, remember, is paste and black is a whole. So I'm going to flip that. That's the little arrow there. So the black. And now here is my brush. Remember, we're not painting. We're actually, it's kind of a weird thing, reversing. So now I'm actually taking out because black creates a hole. It's really small, so I'm going to come a little bit closer. I'm going to take everything out except for my mouth. Now remember, I can always fix all of this. Okay. So this is how you get out your, you get your video playing and you also get the mouth. Actually, it looks like it's almost in the perfect spot. Okay, but what I want to do now, I'm going to grab my move tool is I'm going to kind of pick it up. Oh, look at all that stuff I missed there. And I can um, kind of resize it a little bit so it fits a little bit better. And then I'm going to come back to my paintbrush. Yes, I'm going to apply it. Back to my paintbrush, make sure that this is selected so it works. Then I'll come back and kind of fix stuff up. Um, if I cut some off like that, I could flip this and this kind of paints it back in for me. So um, just something to keep in mind. Okay, now what you want to do is I'm going to go up to um, make sure my animation is showing here. All right, so right now I have um, frames, but I want to flip this um, over right there. So I can kind of kind of see what see what's going on. Now this is my sound button. So I make sure that's on. And then before you do anything else, this little before you play it or anything, this little slider right here, pull that in so it reaches just at least a little bit into that green area. Okay. Then we won't get that weird glitching. All right. So we've got this selected. Then you can hit play to test it out. Make sure that sound is on. Digital media is the best class ever. Okay, and see how it kind of loops. Okay, so I can always come back and fix things if I want to. Okay, so that is for doing the lips. What you will want to do then is you're going to go File, Export, and you're going to render your video.